Hey YouTube, it's Girl You Look Good. I'm back. I haven't did a video in so long. But today's video, I'm going to do a makeup video or color match for the sisters out there that has a hard time matching their skin to the to the foundation that's out there. So I'm going to do a color match so that I got some makeup from MAC. I got a few things from MAC. So I'm going to start by already moisturizing my face. I wash my face, put my witch hazel on, uh, and then I put my moisturizer on, which is a Beano. I love a Beano. So then I'm gonna rub it in. So I'm gonna match my skin to some makeup because during the winter, summertime, my skin get really dark, and my makeup look really ashy. So. I'm gonna try and match it today so first of all I'm gonna put my primer on and you guys I am using Philip magnesium primer for my skin it works really good shake it up yep Philips I use the original as a primer so I use this brush stick it in and just prime my face with it and this works for me. I know a lot of YouTubers use it for their primer. I use it. I try not to get it in my eye. But this is how I prime my skin. And sorry if I look green from my background of my walls. But that is the way it is. So I make sure I put my on my nose. Because my nose get really ashy. I mean, I'm sorry, really oily. So, I put that on it. Okay? So, again, Philips has a primer with a makeup brush. I got a mark, so I won't use it for anything else. So, I use this. All right. So, I'm going to show you how I do my makeup because my skin right now is, it's the color of it is like crazy right now. So, I went to MAC and I got the number 7. Five. And it comes in a bottle like this. So this is this color. And then I have a 7 point. I've used this one a couple of times. 7 point. So I got a 7 and a 7.5. Which one is darker and one is lighter. So I put a this is a I've been mixing it. So for the darker one, I shake it up. And I may put like, what, about four pumps in here. And then the lighter one, I only put, I put um, maybe five because I'm gonna use it for next week. So I'm gonna do five. I did six. And then I take one of my makeup brush and I'll just mix it up. So ladies, if you're having a hard time like I am matching your skin complexion with your um, foundation, I think the best thing we can do is to mix it up. So I'm going to put a little bit more because I think it's still a little too dark. So I'm going to put the 7 in. So I mix it, mix it up. And that's what I do. And then I'm going to try it on my skin. I have a lot of orange and a lot of yellow undertone on my face. So. You can see the yellow. You can see the orange, but I think it's pretty good. I'm going to put another pump of the 7 in it. So I'm going to put another 7 and mix it. So this is how I get my makeup to come as close to my skin complexion while we are in the end of summer, fall, going to fall. And that is what I do. So I take my makeup brush, dip it in. I should have washed it. But then I put it on and see what happens see how it comes out mm 
hope you guys can see it. Not the green. The green on the... Maybe the... I'll just put it on. Okay, my thing looks so doesn't look right. I have to get better lighting next time. But I think it looks looks okay. It matches really good. I don't want to look like I have makeup on. And I also wanted to at least match, this, match my neck. So that's what I try and do. Try to get it to match my neck. So I have it on. Probably can't see it. I hope you can. But that is a good way, I say, to match your skin complexion. If you can't find it over the counter just one bottle I mean I have like four bottles of makeup but this thing to be working right now so I'm gonna use this over into the summer I mean I'm sorry over into the into the winter months and see how it works I don't like my face to look ashy when I put my makeup on If I hear my phone ringing, but that's it. Okay, so I'm gonna finish up and come back and do another video on my a wig that I made and my complete look of my mix makeup. Again, I use Mac, the number seven which is lighter than the number 7.5. So I mix these two together and I got this color. Matches my skin complexion, which that's what I want. So again, um, I'll come back with the finished look and um, my new wig that I made and let you look and see how it looked on me. Okay, all right, thanks, bye.